Primary Arms is out of Texas and started off in 2007 with a mission of providing firearm enthusiast quality optics at affordable prices. Now, they're designed in the United States and they're made in Japan, the Philippines, and China. Yes, China. And those of you that get hooked up on that, good luck finding very many optics that aren't made in China. But hey, it is what it is. Now, their products I have found to be innovative, tough, and unique. And Primary Arms is setting the bar pretty high for the other companies. Now, I've tested several of their optics, and they have done really well, especially with my torture test, where few have failed. Pistol optics are the latest and the greatest, and the market is on fire with pistol optics. You know, maybe it's just because uh, all the folks like me, aging population, where the eyes, you know, they really do better with an optic than the old iron sights. So everyone is looking for the smallest, the lightest, the best quality at the most affordable price. And all that put together is not an easy combination to find. Has Primary Arms done it with their new classic series, the Micro? Only one way to find out. Okay, let's go for the small one here. Okay, and that's 25 yards. Nice, that's 50 yards, guys. I'm Drew Case. Welcome to Beyond Seclusion, where I only give you my honest opinion, and it is what it is. Now, check out the specs and tech on the Micro before we get too far into this and get to shooting on the steel. Okay, so Primary Arms has come out with the new Classic Series. Okay, this is their Micro Reflex Sight. Just quick out of the box. Instruction manual, lens cloth, some Loctite. We've got the optic in here. Okay, now this is a bottom battery. I can't say those are always my, my favorite just because of the submersion test. This is metal. It feels really nice. Um, yeah, this is a good looking sight. Okay, got the wrench and I'm guessing some screws. Here we go, out of the box. Now I know a lot of folks are gonna be looking to put this on a nine millimeter, and um, I, I really have no doubt that it will work just fine with that. I've got a kel P17, and just because the mechanisms of a 22, I really wanted something small and light, and I think this is the absolute perfect fit. So if you have a P17, uh, we're going to find out because I'm going to do a torture test on this and I'm going to end up putting 2,000 rounds through this and I, I think that'll do pretty well for testing the optic. Now also here I've got a mount um, from a guy that I found on eBay. Anyway, check out the mount here. Okay, so the first thing that my wife said when we shot the P17 was, can we get an optic for this? You know, and for... You know, a self-defense concealed carry, a lot of people like a red dot. It was not necessarily made for that, but I did find uh, a product when I did a Google search, Tanner Machine Products. I will show you the, the link here and include that on the eBay. I talked to the owner, and he's just getting kind of started with a business, and he's making these. Also sent me some for the PMR30. But anyway, let's, uh, let's give this a go and see... Uh, if we can get an optic on the P17. Okay, real quick, just want to show you the mount for the P17. It's quality, quality craftsmanship. Everything that you need comes with it. Um, the screws that go in. Anyway, I, I'm impressed. Uh, I'm anxious to get this mounted and see how it works. Okay, to turn this on, it's really simple. We just press and hold the buttons for three seconds, turns it on, and off. 
Now also, this is a bottom mounted battery and I typically do not torture test these, especially the submersion, because most of them, in my experience, end up failing. Um, so if you're looking for something that can go underwater to any depth for any real amount of time, uh, you, you're gonna want a battery that is in a sealed compartment. With that said, um, this was not the intent of this optic and I'm not gonna do the beyond seclusion torture test on this optic. Now along those lines, Primary Arms has a lifetime guarantee, so you really have no worries. You know, I've looked it over, the literature, um, I've got it here, and they have posted on their lifetime guarantee, and I feel pretty confident uh, we're taken care of with this optic under any normal circumstances. Okay, so I'm getting the Primary Arms Micro zeroed on my kel P17. This is actually, I think, the perfect gun for this, either that or the PMR30. I, I did have it on a 9. I switched it over because of just completely lightweight, small footprint, and affordable. It's actually perfect for this. Anyway, I'm getting it zeroed. Um, I'm using the CCI, the green tag, the competition, good stuff. I'm getting some crazy groups here. I wasn't planning on, on doing any of the videoing today. I was just going to get it zeroed because of the wind. Um, but anyway, you got to kind of see this. The adjustments, they, uh, there is no palpable or audible click whatsoever. So as I'm adjusting now, what's works out great is I had the Viridian laser dialed in perfectly so I kind of cheated and just put the two together. The nice thing is is when you have a combo you really only have to sight one in and then you just simply use that one to dial in the other one. Let's take a look. All right, I'm pretty happy with that. I started up here. This was the first group of five. Then I brought it down. I can't remember how many I put in there, but that that was the group. I was really taking my time with that group. Then I made some adjustments, and this is the last 10 shots. Um, I had moved the table. It was wobbling. My turkeys were coming up behind me. So anyway, um, let's, uh, let's put up another target and really focus and see what we can get. But so far, guys, I'm super happy with this. Okay, so this is our sight picture at 25 yards. It's a pretty nice dot. Um, I really like this sight picture. Again, I think this is absolutely perfect for this gun. My time. I wanted to show you, because some people like to know this, the parallax. It does, it has no parallax at 25 yards, parallax free. Okay, let's check out that last group. <laughs> uh, I like that. I really like that. That's 15 shots. You know what? It's just a little bit high, but I think I'm not gonna mess with it. I'm gonna leave it right there. Guys, that rocks. Now it's time to start having some fun that we're on the steel. Now I'm going to double check. I'm going to make sure my laser is in the exact same spot and then we're good to go. Let's just get to shooting and have some fun. Hey folks, are you enjoying this review? If you are, help support the channel, hit that subscribe button. This helps more than just about anything. It's simple, quick, costs you nothing, not a zip, zero, nothing. So hit that button, keep the reviews coming. Now, if you have not visited my webpage, you should for many reasons, like my discount codes for some of the great companies, including ammo, guns, and gear. I have a list of the companies that I use the most and recommend. At the bottom of the page is a list of current discount codes ranging anywhere from 5 to 15% off anything in your cart. Now, you should be interested in my crazy, stupid deals subscription. Here are some of the deals that I found in the past. And when I find these, I now have the ability to share in an instant with everyone that subscribes. And I blast them out in an email as soon as I find them 
It costs you nothing. Unsubscribe at any time. I have saved folks hundreds, even thousands of dollars. Don't take my word. Read the comments. It works. It's awesome. And it costs nothing. If you follow my channel and you shop on Amazon, you can help support and keep the reviews coming by going on to Amazon through my link. Anything and everything you purchase by doing so helps support the channel. You can literally buy toilet paper through my link and it helps support the channel and the reviews. Simply save the link to your phone or your computer and shop as you always do. And check out my highly rated online courses. They come with a 30 day money back guarantee. You got nothing to lose. Literally thousands have found them helpful. Read the reviews and see for yourself. And check out the cooking tips page. There are some awesome recipes on there. Good food and it can literally save you thousands of dollars a year. Thanks for your help. Couldn't do it without you. <laughs> so far flawless okay the amount of time <laughs> to load these mags versus shoot them um, this could be a really really long torture test let's uh let's try a little distance here okay and that's 25 yards try a little transition here we've got Nice, that's 50 yards, guys. And then, you know, then we go. Now, for those that, you know, there's some question about is the 22 viable for self-defense. You know, the thing is, is the ability to get shots on target in incredibly accurate shots in a really small amount of time. Pretty good. Okay, let's go for the small one here. So that's the first 500 rounds of this torture test with the P-17. I'm going to do some with the laser, but as far as uh, the micro, you know, I'm going to stop here. Um, if you want to see how it did with all 2,000 rounds, uh, watch for that review when it comes out. Otherwise, you know, I, I think it's <laughs> it's pretty solid. Not much is going to change, but uh, yeah, there you go. Now, do I think that this would be perfectly at home and do exceptionally well exactly the same on a nine millimeter absolutely i do i have no question i just happen to think that it is and as you can see it's perfect it's ideal for the p17 so you know if you've got a p17 or you've got something that's really um going to need a light optic but you don't want the polymer this is worth looking at there you have it, guys. It is what it is. You decide what you think. I hope you enjoyed the video, found it helpful. If so, help support the channel. Be sure and hit that subscribe button. It really does help the most. Like and comment. Until next time, happy shooting. Remember, educate our young people to shooting and gun safety. And every time we're on the range, we're ambassadors for the Second Amendment. So be a safe and responsible gun owner.